Hey everybody, Blaze and Merc with Achievement Hunters Community Guides, and today we will be getting the Skull Achievement in Mass Effect. In order to get this achievement, you need to have every single species in the game registered in your codex. This can easily be done before you even leave the Citadel. If you do not ask about the Protheans in the intro sequence, you will not be able to get their entry in this playthrough. So when you see the word Prothean or Investigate, be sure to click it if you want this achievement. We need to bring the beacon back to the Citadel to find out. Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. What do you know about the Protheans? Just what they taught us in school. They were a technologically advanced species that ruled the galaxy 50,000 years ago. Then they vanished. Nobody really knows how or why, though I've heard plenty of theories. But everyone agrees galactic civilization wouldn't exist without them. Their Citadel is the very heart of galactic society. And without their mass relays, interstellar travel would be impossible. Be sure to click the get option the call, sir. because it gives we you had the no get idea what we were in walking into down there. That's why things went to hell. The get haven't been outside the veil in two centuries, Commander. The next two entries are found right across the hall from Udina's Third office. You All you have to do is ask place. the Elcor diplomat and the Volus diplomat about their cultures and their histories. Chastising remark. Don't be so rude, Jen. At least introduce yourself. <sighs> I am Din Korlak, Volus Ambassador. Is there something I can do for you, Earth Clan? I'd like to know more about the Volus. I'm sure our history and culture would bore you, Earth Clan. I'm gonna speed things up a bit. Actually, I would like to know more about your history. My people came to the Citadel shortly after the Asari and Salarians had discovered it. We were instrumental in establishing a standardized galactic economy. However, despite our long association with the Citadel and our many contributions to galactic society, we still do not hold a seat on the Council. Tell me about Volus culture. We are tribal by nature, but our ways are not violent. We barter and trade our lands and tribe members in order to increase status. Larger tribes often engulf smaller ones and eventually split again. Our society is very malleable, and our government is always shifting and changing. Since we're not physically adept, we trade our services for protection. Goodbye, Ambassador. Yes, yes. Good day, Earth Clan. Please greeting. Human, it is always good to see your kind. I am Ambassador Kalen. Genuine query. Is there something I can do for you this day? Tell me more about your species. Genuine enthusiasm. I delight in telling the history of my people. It is agreeable to share our culture with others. Tell me about the history and origins of the Elcor. The Elcor were just beginning to explore Council State when the Asari first made contact with us. With their help, we discovered the relay closest to our system, and from there the Citadel. Proudly. Within one lifetime, we established a regular route to the Citadel, and quickly became one of the more active species living on this great station. I'd like to know more about the culture of the Elcor. Frankly, we Elcor prefer the safety and familiarity of our own colonies to the confines of space travel. Our society is built on small, tight-knit groups, though we are always welcoming to outsiders. Our government tends to be very stable. Our people are not very comfortable with sudden changes. Goodbye, Ambassador. Sincere farewell. The next two entries, you have to talk to the VIs like in front of the Citadel the Tower, and the giant Krogan statue. Ask about the Keepers and the Rachni Wars. Central to the operation and maintenance of the entire station. Citadel regulations protect the Keepers against interference during the performance of their tasks. Failure to comply will result in harsh penalties. Keepers can be seen in all sections of the Citadel, but are consequently quashed by the Council. What were the Rachni Wars? Nearly 2,200 years ago, explorers seeking to expand Citadel space opened up mass relays leading to systems controlled by the Rachni. A highly intelligent and aggressive insect race, the Rachni unleashed a war of conquest against the rest of the galaxy that lasted for nearly three centuries. The emergence of the Krogan finally turned the tide in favor of the Citadel species. Krogan forces provided the numbers necessary to halt the Rachni advance and drive them back. The Krogan then pursued their retreating fleets. Able to survive the harsh environments of the Rachni homeworlds, the Krogan hunted their enemy to extinction. Next, talk to the Hanar shopkeeper in the Emporium and just ask about his speech and he will tell you about his culture and you'll get the next entry. For the same reason that humans are so inquisitive, it is part of our culture. Specifically, Hanar only refer to themselves in the first person with family or intimates. And we rarely do so with other species. 
it is just our way. And for the last entry, yes, all you have to do is, after being made a Spectre, talk to Captain Anderson about his mission with Saren, and you will get the last entry and the achievement. Tell me what happened with you and Saren 20 years ago. It's close to 20 years ago now. Ambassador Goyle was our representative here on the Citadel. Like Udina, she wanted to get a human into the Spectrate. She chose me. The Council sent Saren to keep an eye on me and evaluate my performance, just like they sent Nihilus to keep tabs on you. I think I deserve the whole story. We had intel on a rogue scientist who and there we go, 25 Gamer Score and the Scholar Achievement. You can find more videos like this at AchievementHunter.com.